Pizza. 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 This guy served over 30 years, a lot of which has been in solitary confinement. Can you imagine? No human contact or touch or conversation for a decade. We do deserve that. Murder, of course, but we've done that. Not all of us. My point is, look where we are. We're eating pizza, not in jail. Because we had Annalise. Weird. It's not weird. It's because we are not people of color who are systematically abused by a racist justice system. No, I mean, right. What is it? something to do with you missing the IPO announcement yesterday. It's remarkable how important you think you are. <laughs> Why are you covering for me? You told the DA's investigator you thought Simon was behind it all. You don't believe that. I know you don't. So why? Why you say it? You're acting way more stupid than you are right now. Because whatever you and your friends did has put us all in danger. And the fact that you have come to talk to me about that here in a public place tells me you have no idea how scared you should be. And that's saying a lot considering all the scary things I've seen in my life. Don't text, call, or ambush me ever again. Laurel, you ever had thoughts about hurting your father? Do you really want me to be honest? Yes. My whole life, I have had thoughts about hurting my father. But there is Somebody no need to do it. hurting him. Somebody need to Somebody do it. Found out. No. Both of them can't stand either one of them. Sorry. We have a bigger problem. Bonnie Winterbottom. Your mother's files show yeah, a boy. history of mental illness. You believe your father made those up? No. No, he exacerbated them. Are you aware of the female's diagnosis? Mm -hmm. Bipolar 1, rapid cycling. She was diagnosed after she gave birth to me. She was hospitalized till she was so drugged out that she was no longer considered a danger herself or others. But that's not me. I've never shown any symptoms, ever. There's no reason for me to want to hurt myself or anyone else. And if I did, She is still showing signs of depression and wanted to side with the original doctor's recommendation. My father paid off that doctor. Let me finish it, Elise. I countered, pointing out that her hormone levels are already normal. She shows no homicidal or suicidal ideation, and being that her baby was just taken away from her, she's doing about as well as anyone could hope for. The administrator agreed and granted Laurel immediate release. Uh, I'm staying here. I don't need a bodyguard. Yes, you do. Why do you still have Dominic's phone? I forgot to toss it. Don't lie. Tell me why you still have his phone. Tell me. Play it. Play what? I'm sure. Play what? It's her stuff. I'm in trouble. We all could be. Call me as soon as you get this. It's her stuff. 
Not in trouble. We all could be. Call me as soon as you get this. It's Kristoff. She finna answer. Don't answer it. No. Lord, that's your father. He's been calling every day. Give me the phone. He doesn't know how many states. Don't answer. You're both wrong. Give me the phone. Don't be stupid. It's not my father. Hi, Mom. Get away with murders by Ola Davis on the new Kimmel later tonight. Okay. Lauren! Hi, Mom. Next Thursday, the custody showdown begins. Miss Castillo woke up restrained and discovered that her father had stolen a son. Just give me what I want. And it ends. I'm my life on the line. With one heart stopping. Were you the mother that Laurel deserved? Jaw dropping. How many men were you sleeping with? No, I don't. Verdict. The judge has a decision. How to get away with murder, all new next Thursday on ABC. Okay. Um, this episode wasn't as good as last week's episode. Uh, so, yeah, man. Um, okay, I thought it was going to be something crazier than that. But it is what it is. But, um, yeah, man, what did y'all think about tonight's episode? Did you like it? Did you not like it? Was it lackluster to you? You think it was better than last week's? Don't see how, but, you know. Uh, yeah, I don't really have much to say about this episode. Um, Laurel's mom is coming next week. Don't know what she's going to be up to. Let me just say, just a reminder... I still think it was a dumb decision to kill Wes. Stupid. Really stupid. That They didn't have to do that. And, uh, I'm just waiting on, um, what's his name? Mr. Castillo to get his ass whooped. You know, this is a message to the creators of how to get away from murder. Cast me in the role and have my character whoop his ass. Because I want to whoop Mr. Castillo's ass, alright? But, yeah, man. Um, I can't wait to see his him get his, alright? I know what's going to happen. I don't know when, though. But, uh, yeah, man. Let's talk more about this in the comment section down below. Or if you want to follow me on social media. Those links will be in the description, alright? Uh, if you like this video, make sure you click that thumbs up button. Also, click that subscribe button. I got a goal of a thousand subscribers. All right, so let's let's reach that goal. All right. Uh. Yeah. Like always. Like, share, subscribe. I'll see y'all in the next video.